All I can say is don't ever take my word for the weather, okay? If you guys watched yesterday's video, I said, oh yeah, spring's here. <sighs> Look what it did last night. It snowed again. Again. Just what I thought. I had all this weather figured out, barometric pressures and all that. She just went and just face crushed me and snowed. Anyway, day two of the hikes, guys. Day two was a little bit harder. I went a different route. It's a lot harder now I think about it. But it's good. I feel good. I feel like I can conquer the world. Honestly, it takes me like two days of exercising. I think, oh man, I'm going to be so ripped this summer. And then like a week later, I give up on it. I'm fat. Just kidding. I'm not going to do that this year though. I'm committed. I committed myself. I'm going to stay committed. Because every time I work out, I feel like I'm on drugs. I'm not on drugs, guys. I'm on oxygen. I guess if oxygen was a drug, it is addictive. It does make you feel better. So maybe oxygen is a drug. The more oxygen you get into your blood, the better you feel. See, look at me, I'm just talking, you know, it's funny. Every time somebody starts working out, they just become a workout expert. That's me, I'm a workout expert. Get more oxygen in your blood. You'll feel better and you'll be on drugs. There. Anyways, beautiful morning. Look at it. It's gorgeous. I'm not predicting what could happen today with weather. We could have a tornado, who knows, earthquake, tsunami. We'll just see. All right, I'm getting, I'm gonna go finish this hike. I'm uh, two and a half miles in, so hopefully it'd be about a five mile hike. Look at fresh coyote tracks right there. I know they're fresh because it snowed last night. So we are down here at Gage's favorite store, right? <laughs> and, uh, Braley started doing track and field two weeks ago, or last week. She's throwing the discus. Uh, so is Gab Man. He's throwing the discus and uh, shot put. So we're coming down here to see if they have a discus and a shot put that we can get so we can practice at home. I can pretty much throw a discus over that mountain, that mountain over there. A shot put is just a big, giant, round ball that's really heavy. Oh, and it has like a little handlebar? Nope. And it's a kettlebell. We could practice with one though. And you spin it around really fast and then you throw it? Yeah. But with the shot put, you do this. Put it like right here behind your neck and spin around and then throw it. I think. For every time I've ever thrown a big steel ball, that's what I did. Well, Wieners is not our favorite store anymore, is it Gage? Uh -uh. I'm never shopping there again. Big five, here we come. Our mission, we failed. We completed it just on that much. Yeah. So we went to town. We went to every sporting goods store in Pocatello, which there's like really only like three of them that would possibly sell a discus or a uh, shop put. Not one person carries them. I kept telling every store, I'm like, you should carry them. You'd be the only one. But maybe there's just no, uh, there's not a lot of people looking for shop puts and discus here in town. But there is a college here that has a track team, so you think maybe. Anyway, we'll have to order them. But when we we're in town, we went for shot put, and uh, the only team we were coming back with is a new pistol. <laughs> <laughs> so we got a new pistol while we were in town. That was Gage's call. Yeah. He like made the call. I like that. He made the call. It's. And I uh, sort of want to shoot it, but. Gage sort of wants to shoot the pistol. Yeah, I just I. I I owned a pistol for a few years and then I got rid of it. I'm not a huge gun guy. I don't, I don't know if you guys watch the Hush channel. It's my hunting and fishing channel. I love to hunt. I love to fish. I love to spend time outdoors. I'm not a huge, like, I don't love guns. I don't love going out shooting guns, like, endlessly. I love shooting my bow endlessly. I can do that every day, all day long. Um, guns, I like shooting my Weatherby rifle. And that's just to get myself ready for the hunts, the upcoming wing hunts. But I don't own a ton of guns because I'm not a, a gun nut. But I just feel like I need to own a pistol. And there's a couple of reasons why. Uh, obviously, protection is number one. Um, just so many crazy things happen in this world. And uh, the great state of Idaho just passed a law that anybody, I believe, over the age of 21 can carry uh conceal carry which means you don't have to get a permit but you can just do it uh it's always been the law in most every state i know that you can carry you can't not just 
you can't conceal, but you can just carry like on your hip. That's just kind of how it's always been. But just every time I'm in a movie theater or somewhere in a public place, I always think like if something was to happen and I wasn't prepared to protect myself and my family and other people and something happened, I would never forgive myself. So I decided a pistol was a good investment just for uh, protection, obviously. So plus we're gonna go out and shoot it and have fun, right? And a rifle. And a rifle. But uh, I'm gonna teach Kaylee how to shoot this pistol so when I'm gone. After and, she's uh, pregnant, after she's pregnant. Uh, yeah, after she's pregnant. After she's done being pregnant. Yeah. Yes, please. Yes, please. Yes, please. Yes, please. Yes, please. Yes, please. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. What are you going to say yes about? Um, BLTs, one of my favorite And Winston got, what'd you get? Kissing? Are you going to sing? Are you going to sing? Sing for us, let's hear you sing. Sing. Come on, let's hear you sing. What does that loud. Say? Remember what that says? Okay. What does it say about the butt? I got a big butt. He's like yeah. what? Brayley, raise your hand before you talk to me, please. That's a rule in the house. What's that? No, put your hand down. Put your hand down. BLTs? BLTs for Din Din. This actually sounded really good to me too. What's that? This sounded really good to me too. It did, huh? Good job. Suggesting it. BLTs and soup. Bacon actually sounds good. Bacon. And what else? Bacon. Bacon. Big belly bacons. I got a short throat. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Thanks, Bray. We're running up the hill. Alright, guys. We're gonna eat dinner, go to bed. It's crazy because the time change now. Uh, the kids' bedtime is 9 o'clock. Probably a little early for some of you guys, but that's the rule on school nights, right? I love this time change. Is it it's yeah, it's 8.30 though right now, 8.15. We're eating a little late, but look how bright it is outside. That means, you know what that means? What does it mean? Spring. Almost summer. 34 days left of school. 34 more days were left of school. Only Braley would be bummed about that. I'm so <laughs> sad. Well, I'm actually I'm sad because like my I don't like school because she's my friends. friends. 